Hey everyone, David here from NAMM Show 2019. I'm here with Jason, the founder and creator of the OnSong app for iOS. Jason, we love what you're doing. And uh, actually here on the floor, we've got OnSong uh, changing patches in main stage in Sunday Keys. So I thought maybe you could tell us a little bit about OnSong and a little bit about how you're uh, combining these two programs and making them work together. We'll do, yeah. Hey, so uh, it's great to meet David. I mean, I've just started using Sunday Keys live on a Sunday, and it's made a huge difference in my performance. And of course, I use OnSong, so I said, well, gee, I wonder how I can get this to work together. And OnSong is basically a contextual MIDI controller. Uh, so you can basically have your song and then assign any MIDI you want to it. Um, so for instance, if I just tap on the title here, it's going to bring up a little menu where I can assign any MIDI I want to send. Um, and you know, since Mainstage uses program changes really easily for patches, I just throw in a program change there just as easily as doing this. So I'm just going to throw in a program, tell it what program I want, and you can name these if you want. So we can just do this, you know, and then of course you could delete, oh, I picked the same one, you know, but whatever. And then, you know, you switch between your songs, Mainstage automatically switches for you. And what, what's really cool is, right, with this little demo, we, we don't have any wires at all. I mean, it's all wireless. Uh, so we have, you know, your iPad is set up as a Bluetooth uh, MIDI uh, host. We're connecting the Mac using, obviously, Mac's uh, audio MIDI setup. We have a little keyboard here. And then down here, we have some AirTurn S2, S4 pedals, which can be configured as a MIDI over Bluetooth device. So we have this just set up as a sustain pedal, and we're turning our tonic on and off our ambient tracks with the other buttons. So super cool, super easy, you know, and um, you know, some churches, my church at least, you know, we pick our set list probably a little too soon to the service start, you know? I can't uh, you know what I mean? But the great thing is with the technology and with Sunday Keys, you can do that. You know, you can figure out that sound on the fly, figure out your songs on the fly, and it just works. So uh, yeah, we're super excited to see that happen. Nice. So you can do program change. Can you do like CC as well, or is that coming in soon? Yeah, so you, you could definitely do control change. You could do node events. Um, and one of the cool things that we just added is something we're calling uh, global uh, MIDI globals. Um, so for instance, if I go in here, oh, let me just do it this way. If I come here and hit plus, I can pick what's called a global. And a global allows me to uh, configure a list of MIDI and then edit it in one place. So let's say I always want to turn my vocal harmonizer on, right? And maybe it's like a couple MIDI control, you know, control changes, program changes, whatever. I could do that in one place, put it in my songs, and then if I have to make a change or I add a new piece of equipment, I change it in one place. And it applies everywhere, so that's a cool thing. And the other thing coming from MIDI, because we're at the MIDI booth here at NAMM actually, is something called MIDI CI, our capability inquiry, where soon you'll be able just to see like what patches uh, the connected keyboards have and just pick the patch. You don't even have to think about programming MIDI or anything like that. So that's going to make it more accessible uh, for end users, just like what David's been doing, what we've been trying to do, make it easy for people that are willing to give up their time and sacrifice that time and give it over to God on Sunday morning. Jason, that is awesome. We're excited about what you're doing with OnSong. Thanks for sharing a little bit about what you're up to. Thank you. All right. Thanks, everybody.